Good morning, everyone. Well, it's morning here. Good afternoon, good night, good evening, wherever you are. Today is one of my favorite videos. It's my Sips by unboxing. I do plan to have nicer backgrounds, maybe seasonal backgrounds. I just kind of couldn't do that this time. Um, but I like this. This is kind of cozy. It looks, you know, kind of feels personal. I did just wake up. Um, I do have my bean sleeping in the next room, which explains the soft-spoken voice. No, I'm not changing into an ASMR channel. <laughs> I kind of just have to film when I can, and the best time to film is when she's sleeping or when dad's home. <laughs> I'm really excited. I, you know, I got my box a little bit late this month. I got it on the 10th, uh, which isn't horrible, but I usually get it within the first week of the month. Um, not sure what's up with that, but whatever. This is the box for December, and let's get into it. I, I have really been enjoying every tea that I get in my Sips by box, but it's very overwhelming sometimes because when I go on my on my Sips by page and you know they have kind of like the list of all the offers and you can just click and it'll take you straight to their website. Um, and I'm so undecided because I feel like you know I really enjoy the tea from Asheville and I checked out their website and. Uh, hmm, should I put an order here? And then I also um, enjoyed some teas from the OLLT, I think it's called, OLLT Company. Um, there's several companies I've, I've checked out their websites and it's like, I don't know. I mean, I, I, I've seen things that I've been interested. I just, I can't make all the orders that I want to make. It's, it's hard. I've, I've almost made a couple orders, but I'm like, oh no, should I just, uh, I don't know. <laughs> so first things first, you always get your card that kind of just explains a little bit about the teas. It says, happy holidays. Tea has been a part of seasonal traditions in many cultures around the world. For us, it's warm, comforting cup of joy to share with loved ones. Oh, okay, I see a tea already that I'm like really excited that I got. But let's just, this is by the company Syra, Syra Tea and Fusion, Massinissa. <clears throat> it's a green tea with ginger and citrus. I did see this on my offers page, and I was confused whether I had gotten a tea from this already, but I think it was just because it was in the box that I hadn't opened yet, which is this one. Um, I love green tea. You know what's funny is like I I haven't really, I've been like on the fence about green tea because I, I do like green tea. It's just sometimes they can be very grassy, but I do enjoy the ones that I enjoy. But I feel like almost even the grassiest teas can be really good if you brew them correctly. And there have been some teas that I've had where I'm like, ooh, it's a little bit grassy, but because I kept trying them and changing the process and how I make it every time, it's always gotten better and better. So my love for green tea now is like, that's the first thing I have in the morning now is a cup of green tea with a little bit of lemon. Um, I heard that green tea is actually really good for weight loss in the morning. Um, I think I mentioned this in another video that I used to drink green tea in the morning and that's how I lost a lot of weight. And I would put a shot of apple cider vinegar in there. Um, I'm still not quite there yet. I will do that, but that was rough. Um, but I'm really excited to have another green tea. This blend, it says low caffeine. This blend is named after Massinissa, the ancient Berber king who fought glorious battles to unify the Maghreb. Maghreb. 
He declared Africa belongs to Africans, which became a famous quote. Wow, that's really cool. It's a green tea with ginger, lemongrass, lemon peel, orange blossom, and natural flavor. And that's another thing is, is I've gotten really into citrus teas, which that was probably that. <laughs> I think it's an acquired thing because that and peppermint teas have been like my least favorite. But I've been really enjoying a couple peppermint teas. I still can't do peppermint on its own, like just peppermint leaves. But I'm warming up. You know what I mean? It's kind of like wine or sushi or beer. It's it's an acquired thing. You can't just try it the first time and think, nope, never going to like this. Because it's more of like an understanding, an appreciation. I feel like that with food and tea and people sometimes. <laughs> Oh, so, let's see. How many sachets? Yeah, you got four sachets. Oh, I'm missing a sachet here. Um, okay, am I going insane here? I feel like, okay. Um, okay, well sucks. I just talked about how excited I am about getting green tea. And I only got three sachets, which it doesn't say how many sachets I should have gotten, but I usually, when they come in sachets, I usually get four sachets. This time, I got three sachets. That's a bummer. Ticino? Ticino? I'm sorry if I don't pronounce these right, okay? Roasted carob, rooibos, chicory, dates, dandelion root, cinnamon, ginger, natural spice flavor, cardamom, sweet blackberry leaves, black pepper, and clove. That sounds really, really good. Wow. Can I read that again? Roasted carob, rooibos, chicory, dates, dandelion root, Cinnamon, ginger, natural spice flavor, cardamom, sweet blackberry leaves, black pepper, and cloves. It says caffeine free. This antioxidant rich blend of dandelion, rooibos, and spices will make up your organs and will wake up your organs and provide gentle stimulation without the need for caffeine. So you can give your adrenals a break. Red rooibos, medium roast. So, I did get four of these guys, so I'm actually really excited. Maybe I will have one of these this morning. Oh wait, there's no caffeine in this one. Huh. Well, we'll have it later today then. Then we have <laughs> Fava Tea Company. Is this my first Fava Tea? I think this might be my first Fava Tea. Fava Tea Company reindeer drool caffeine free herbal tea this loose leaf tea is blended with apples orange blackberries almonds carrots star anise cinnamon cranberry and pomegranate apple pieces orange peel hibiscus blossoms blackberry leaves almonds carrots shreds star anise seed cinnamon silver linden blossoms freeze dried cranberries Cranberry spices, pomegranate, arils, and rose petals. Caffeine free. This celebrated annual must-have herbal blend is only available for the holidays. It's all it all started when Fava Tea gave this tea to Santa, who said this tea made the reindeer drool. Reindeer drool. And we shall try this today probably too. Jeez, I wish I had a little more than two cups. Oh, there's a little, there's a little window. Oh, my light's a little bright. Good luck there. And last but not least, and one of my favorites. This is Cardamom French Toast by David's Tea. Medium caffeine with 
It's a black tea with cinnamon, coriander seeds, cardamom, coconut sugar, cane sugar, uh, and flavoring. This sweet, buttery, cardamom spiced black tea with a dusting of cinnamon sugar tastes like the decadent breakfast of dreams. You'll be craving this brunch tea all day long. I love this tea. I love this tea. So it's actually really nice to have. Well, there's probably about three or four cups in here. With every box, of course, I know I sound like a broken record, but just in case you're watching this video for the first time, Sipspy provides you with a reusable muslin tea bag, but inside it also has disposable tea bags that you can put your, you know, your loose leaf tea in, like, like the cardamom French toast. And they are a cinch bag with this cute little tag that says Sips By. Put your tea in, <sniffs> steep, and you can throw. I love these, and I love that they give them to you in every box. I'm establishing quite a collection now. I don't think I've seen this many handouts in a box before, but we've got quite a few things here. There's a Fava Tea Company hot tea instructions, um, like bookmark, and it's got like tea tips and stuff like that on it. It's kind of cool. The Ticino flyer. Oh, oh, okay. So it's a card about the creator. Very cool. I'll learn and read about that. So I'm gonna guess that this is something that you gift to someone if you want to gift them a Sips by box and you kind of write the code up there and how much it's worth. Another card from Sips by Dear Tea Lover, I started Sips by a year and a half ago to make discovering tea fun personalized and affordable for tea lovers like me. I'm surprised at how quickly it has taken off. You're making my dream possible and I can't thank you enough. By subscribing to Sipspy, you made it clear that this service is much needed. The team and I are using that as motivation to continue making Sipspy even better. In appreciation of your support, we want to extend this special offer for you to treat yourself or someone you love. You can even add Sips by to your own holiday wish list. Gift codes can be applied to new, current, and past subscriptions. Here's to many years of discovering great tea together. With a love for tea, Stacy. You know, she actually sent an email out not that long ago, and it was really cool because she was talking about how she had only started Sips by a year and a half ago and she actually had been packaging her Sips by box, uh, her shipping her Sips by boxes from her living room up until like I think July and she had pictures of like you know people who work with her and she had about like 10 people in there and I thought that is so cool like she is really a real person who just started this company literally out of her home and in the email she talked about how she actually has to rent a warehouse now to you know expand her business so that's my sips by box for the month of December thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video bye